Hello viewers, this is Dr. Fast here. Yes, you're looking at my Nissan Pathfinder in the dark, but let me show you what I just installed on this vehicle. What you're looking at is a projected image of the Nissan logo onto the floor. I think this looks super cool. Now, if you want to see how to install this, stay tuned. For this install, I'll be using these door LED projector shadow lights. And because I'll be installing this onto my Nissan, obviously I chose a Nissan logo. Now these ones will be installed on the front door of my Nissan Pathfinder and it will replace the factory lights. Now in some sedans and SUV, you may have door lights on all four doors. If you have that, you can actually install four of them. But on mine, it's only the front two doors. So let's have a closer look at one of these lights. Here's a look at the back. So with the design of this light, there is a high power LED inside this casing right here. And this outer casing is all metal to help dissipate heat because it does get very warm. And then the light gets projected from the top to the front right here. And you can see there's a lens right here. Now on the side, this black part right here, you can actually pull this out and there's a microfilm in there with the logo. So after installation, if you find the logo, perhaps it's not lined up properly, you can open this up rotate that logo so it's lined up properly and then insert it back in. On this end we have the connector where you connect to the factory harness. Now on mine I did notice that the pins was not straight so I had to straighten that out otherwise the factory connector won't be able to plug into it. So let's go to the vehicle and get these installed. Here's a door light that I need to remove. To remove this light simply pull the bottom edge towards you Using a screwdriver, push on this tab right here, and then the connector will disconnect. Here's a close-up look at how you can remove that microfilm. You can open this up and then rotate the film so it lines up perfectly. After you're done, put it back in. Now we'll connect the new lights. So let's see how it looks in the dark. As you can see, the image is projected onto the floor. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Now, if you want to do this mod on your Nissan vehicle, I will include the link in the description below. Now, this door light is actually used on many different Nissan vehicles. So you might want to check out the one you have so you can possibly install this light on your Nissan vehicle. Let me know what your thoughts about this installation. If you have any questions or comments, leave one in the comment section. And if you like this video, don't forget to click on a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.